Snowpiercer, which airs Mondays at 9 on TNT. Congratulations on the show. It's season three. Mm -hmm. The show is massive. Yeah. The, 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 the show is absolutely huge. For anyone who doesn't know, tell us what's happening this season. Oh, man. I don't even know. There's, like, uh, the end of season two, there were... Leighton, who I play, had, like, gotten a few people together and, like, separated off a small part of the train. So now there's, like, a pirate train. And we're out. It's pretty much like Euphoria. It's pretty much the same. <laughs> there, it's like uh, we're out, you know, looking for warm spots and mm. trying to find Melanie, who's played by Jennifer Connelly. But meanwhile, Mr. Wilford's on the big train, like, being a bad guy. And uh, it's, yeah, it's a, it's a, it's a, there's so much stuff happening, guys. Yeah. You should watch the show. It's so... I am exhausted already even trying to introduce it. It's brilliantly acted, brilliantly directed, brilliantly written. I, I, the show is huge. But you have a, there's a serious beard on the show. It is, yeah, it's a lot of beard acting. And that's a real beard. You that's don't, me. That's, that's not, that's me. not a no, fake no, beard. No, no, now, no, do yeah. you, do you enjoy having such a, such a substantial beard, or is it the sort of thing where you're like, I cannot wait to shave this? It's beard. when it, at, this is my ritual, last day, as soon as they call cut on the last shot of the season, I run straight to the trailer. Like, everyone's wheeling champagne out or whatever, mm. and I run straight to the hair trailer, and then I'm, I shave it off, because then they can't do any reshoots. <laughs> yes! <laughs> That's it. That's smart. I'm out. You know you what I do yeah. on the last shot when they say, if I'm filming something, they yeah. go, cut, I... Bang, break someone's toe. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's the end of, an end of show ritual is just something that I do. I, mean, <laughs> I missed out on this secret to success. <laughs> <laughs> no one told now, me Sydney, I want to talk to you about this. You were so brilliant in The White Lotus, which <laughs> arguably one of the biggest smashes of the year. <laughs> you, I think, have really nailed giving the most withering, judgmental looks to anybody crossing your path. In fact, the Have New I? York Times called you one of the scariest girls on TV. <laughs> right? Because yes. your, your side eye, <laughs> your side eye look is amazing. So I'm going to give you some scenarios. Okay. And you show me what the best sort of side eye sort of over it look okay. you can imagine, okay? So, I might, I'll just like react. Sure. Yeah. So okay. when your stepdad says, it's lit. <laughs> okay, what about this? What about this? The guy you're into just texted that he can't hang out until 10 p.m. And could you come over to his place instead? Mm. <laughs> okay. <laughs> David, I'm going to give you one. It's devastating. David, can you give okay, me a good side eye? Can you give me a good side eye? What about this one? I'll, I've learned from the best. Friend. Okay. When your parents ask if they'll be serving alcohol at the party. Mm. <laughs> Reggie, do you have a question for our guest this evening? Uh, yes, I do. Tonight's uh, question goes to... Uh, to both of our guests. Uh, a huge fan of both of you. You're, you're both incredible. Thank you for your service. <laughs> Uh, since both of you uh, uh, are both actors, uh, I wonder, would you ever entertain uh, taking a role that puts you in the middle of a hierarchical structure of human behavior that's based around some kind of a dynamic that has to be resolved because of tension from kind of binary uh, tensions between two different factions or more? I could... I could see myself maybe taking a role like that. I could. It sounds like you're describing television. And <laughs> I could see myself on it. Yeah. <laughs> Sydney, any thoughts? I mean, maybe it was a musical. <laughs> uh, those are both beyond correct. <laughs> it's beyond correct. Ladies and gentlemen, please thank Sydney Sweeney, David Jake. Stick around. Joy Crooks is here with music when we come back.